Hi, I'm Duke. I want to show you this 2012 321 RKS. The RKS very simply means a rear kitchen. Um, you notice first thing in here, you got a lot of counter space in this kitchen. Real solid surface countertops, very nice cabinets. If you look through here, I mean, you got a lot of a lot of storage space through, all throughout your throughout your kitchen. Um, Of course, the solid surface sink covers as well. You got stainless steel deep sinks, and you got two nice size sinks that you can actually use a high rise faucet to kind of give you more room. Tell you what, those right there, when you pick them up, you can tell there's something to them. Right back here, of course, you got a monitor panel to where you can check all your. All your tank levels, your battery level, turn your water pump on here if you're not hooked up at a park to the uh, to the hose. Turn your hot water heater on right here and that turns on gas or electric. Of course you have the three burner cooktop, you have the oven, your microwave, 6.3 cubic foot refrigerator right here. Of course you got a refrigerator on bottom and the freezer on top. Give you the nice wood on the outside of here. That's, you know, just kind of matches the whole look of the camper here. Of course, you have an adjustable, um, <laughs> excuse me, you have adjustable shelves here where you can adjust these out. If you want to put cereal in there, you can, or if you want to put canned goods and kind of give yourself more room in there, you can also. One of the best features, though, of course, I, I'm just, I can't help it. I'm just really really like these u-shaped dinettes they give you so much more room uh, of course like I've said in other videos you've got your cup holders there this makes out into a large bed so sleeping two extra adults right here is not a problem I like the table they put in here nice wood finish that is real wood no particle board or anything it's all solid wood also the same thing with all your cabinets they're all solid wood um, you know, your styles and everything are all hard and, you know, real wood there. Something that's going to hold up and last a long time. And that's what the Spree is all about. The Spree is the trailer you get when you're wanting a trailer that's going to last you a long time. And when you're wanting to be able to just go anywhere and do what you want to do, that's the Spree. You got the two recline, or I'm sorry, two chairs in this one right here where you can just kick back, watch your TV. Large windows. This camper does have a lot of large windows. I can't really open them up and show you right now. I'll show you to you on the outside. But if I open them up, it'll be too dark and you can't see me in the in the video. Of course, you have the sofa here, just opposing the chairs. This is. A jackknife sofa, so you do have storage up underneath. Uh, it does make out into a bed, be good for sleeping one or two children. More storage. Entertainment center right here. Of course, you've got AM, FM, CD, DVD. You have your USB right there, so you can plug up and put all your music on there. Nice 26 inch television. It is surround sound, so you do have surround sound all throughout here. Uh, of course, there's more storage up through here. Put your video tapes and everything in, and of course, more storage down there for the same. Right in here is our weight sticker. This camper right here is a 32 foot with two slide outs, and it's got, and it only weighs 6,630 pounds. And that's because of the all aluminum framing. It's actually six sided of the aluminum. If you come back here, of course, we've got a little hallway area. But right here is your air conditioner thermostat. You do have a 15,000 BTU air conditioner. Uh, so down here in the south, you don't have to worry about it during the summertime. Slide out controls, wall switches. Your awning, which your awning is electric, you just hit the button and it goes out or comes in. Love this bathroom. This bathroom right here, I mean, it's nice, it's wide, it, it's open up to where you can actually move. Some of the bathrooms in RVs are just kind of crunched together, but not this one. You get the full shower in here. Um, 
of course you have the skylight up under or up over top there your hot and water control sprayer that you can take off I mean it's nice to have an actual shower you can move around and actually take a shower in of course your sink you got a mirror here over here I don't know if you can see it but you do have a medicine cabinet here more storage up underneath the up underneath the sink there you have a foot flush toilet here which is convenient this is actually part of a slide out right here this is that second slide and it goes into the bathroom and bedroom and it's really just designed to give you a wardrobe or a place to put your towels and everything extra drawers and all into your bathroom and you have a door right here which will actually close off the bedroom and bathroom area you come on into the uh, bedroom here you'll see right here some hanging space more drawers down below give you a nice flat surface there it'd be great if you wanted to use a laptop or something like that there or if you just wanted to sit there and put your makeup on in the morning drawers and cabinets I mean really and truly just trying to give you storage a uh, little extra space up here right here they give you a nice nightstand right beside the full queen bed more storage there give you an outlet here so if you want to plug up a clock radio or something you can there again just more storage more storage more storage um, got nice struts up under the bed that lift it up and if you notice that goes all the way a ton of storage there that is accessible from the outside as well as the inside but I mean just a nice area just to put more stuff over here in the bedroom you do have a place for a television and if you could kind of look right here this says satellite so this unit is completely prepped for your satellite it's also prepped for your cable and antenna it's got a 12 volt booster so if you're out in the middle of nowhere you can hit that 12 volt booster and it's going to give you an extra few channels of course an outlet you do have an outlet on the other side of the bed as well and people I haven't really talked about it yet in this unit but if you notice this roof does have a curb and um, it's because of the dome on the outside you know we're trying to water is never good for a camper so the more we can divert the water off the roof the better off we are but also it gives you extra height inside of here uh, I don't have to worry about it too much but the guy with the camera who's 6'4 he appreciates it very much <laughs> but if you could I mean just take a close look here people just for a second I mean if you notice just the openness that this trailer has if you're wanting to go somewhere and you're wanting to stay a month or two you want to be somewhere you're comfortable this is the unit you can be very comfortable in the outside I'm gonna walk outside here um, just to show you a couple of small things if you notice you do have a triple step entry assist grab handle unit is fiberglass all the way around 